Hello guys, Sorin here. Welcome to our next video from um, from this series. I will show you now how to create a free account on a, a free builder website platform like uh, Wix.com. Right now, as you can see here in my browser uh, bar, I am on Wix.com. Okay, I'm already logged into my account. It's actually very, very easy to use. You don't have to, to overthink this. Okay, if I will log out of my account, uh, and I enter on Wix.com, I will have the option to either create an account or sign in. And if I press the button sign in, I will also have the, the option to sign in with my Facebook account. So it's not even that complicated. If you are already logged into Facebook, you enter on Wix.com, you practically press the button sign in, you will have the option sign in with Facebook, you sign into Facebook, and this is the dashboard that you will see after signing in. As you have seen, I've already made some tests here, created some websites, but in this da dashboard, what you want to do for your webinar page or webinar platform, you press the button, I need a site for, the one that you see right here on the screen. You press the button, I need a site for, you can select the option blog, okay, events, music, whatever you want, but I will select the option blog and I, I will have some templates right now, okay, that I can use. I will select one uh, particular template, it doesn't matter, okay, which one it is. For example, I can take this one, advertising. I will press the button edit. And now I wait for the editor to load. And you will see how actually easy it is to use this. Okay, okay. We are in the editor right now, okay, we are on the main page. And let's see, we have all these things that you will probably don't need, okay, for your, uh, for your, um, for your, uh, practically for your webinar page, okay? So you don't need all this stuff right here. You have a text that you can edit, but you don't need it manage posts, you have posts here, so you don't need all this stuff, we should probably look for a different, uh, a different template, this one is too complicated, I don't like it. Okay, background, page, site, tools. Okay, my dashboard, okay, so I will go and find a different template because I don't like this one. Okay, I need the site for, we need something much, much more simpler. Okay, because you only need one page, so no more than that, okay guys? And let's say, no, not this one, let me. Okay, let's say we take this one, okay? Ice cream, okay, it doesn't matter, we wait for the editor to load. because I want to show you how simple it is, okay? You just need a very simple web page, you don't need, oh, this this one is complicated too. God damn it. Okay. Doesn't matter, you can practically delete everything that is on your page and you don't like, even the menu, if you don't need it, but you won't need it actually, that's the, the thing. Okay. So you practically delete everything that's on your page. You will find a good template if you look to, okay? Now I have to delete this because I have selected this for you. Anyways, I won't stay to, okay, in this example to delete actually everything because it will take us like forever. Here you can have the title for your webinar if you want to. So I'm not saying you should delete this. Maybe you want to say like free webinar, okay? Maybe change the font a little. I don't like this one. Okay, it's not. Okay, this one is much better. Size, increase the size. As you can see, this is actually very, very easy to use. Okay, you have an address here. You can delete this one too, or maybe you want to have like a subtitle. Okay, I will just leave it like that, okay? Now you go to this option here, to the button add. Okay. And here you have different options. Okay, shape, video, music, social, contact. Uh, menu, list, blog, more, okay? You go to the video part and you select, for example, YouTube. 
that is if you want to embed here on your page okay the link that your hangout or your webinar will have for youtube so you just press the youtube button you select the size that you want and here you will have these settings okay and in this section here you will copy the link that you will see me copy from the hangout okay the youtube link where your webinar will be displayed you copy it from your hangout or from your youtube channel and you co you copy and paste it right here you press then update and voila your webinar will be displayed here and that's how simple it is guys okay that's how simple it is if you will look in wix here you have more options okay image gallery buttons you can add maybe if you want to to sell something at the end of your webinar you can add a button from here link it to your paypal account okay so people can pay you you can add a box in which you can add maybe a, a chat box or something like that you can add the social account okay so people can uh, can share the webinar okay uh maybe like it or something like that a contact okay somewhere where people can practically leave their contact details and so on okay you can add different plugins you have a lot of plugins if you go here okay site login you have embed the site html code so you have a lot a lot of uh, a lot of different options here with uh, wix.com you just have to look through all of these plugins see what you want to use okay and use it but most of all you will only use probably this the social account the buttons and maybe something like a chat box so you can communicate with your audience directly here on your website okay but mainly this is how it will look like don't forget you select the video you go to the settings button and here you copy your youtube link from your hangout okay if you want to copy directly the hangout okay embed the uh, the, the code of the hangout you go to the add section you go to more and here you have html code you add the, the html code you enter the code here and here you paste the code of your google hangout the embedment code and you press update and that's it guys it's that simple okay now after you will have everything set up on this page you press the button publish you will have here the option free webinar okay you can obviously if you have a custom domain where you want to practically uh, you have a custom address where you want this, this page to appear you connect it to your customized domain okay free webinar save and continue and that's it guys you are done your site was saved if you go to this address right now you press the button publish now okay view site let's have a look at it voila very very nice right so this is actually very very nice this is how your page will look like it looks very clean very smooth very very professional thank you guys very much for your attention i hope that you have understand how to use a free website builder like, like wix i've showed you this one because in my opinion it's the easiest to use and the best for what you need in uh, in this case okay for uh, a small clean a simple clean uh, webinar page thank you guys i will see you in our next video bye bye for now 